Welcome back, Softball 605. I'm down on the lower half of Harmadon, where the 12U teams are playing, and I'm with Diamonds Destruction, Sierra, and Samantha. And ladies, before we got it kind of going on with the interview, there were some things happening behind the scenes. Um, share with us what, what's fun about Ringneck and being with your team here. Well, this is actually my first year on, well, um, Fast Pitch and Diamonds Destruction. So, well, spe what's special about um, Ring Neck is that I've never done something like this before, so it's kind of cool, and it's international, so it's different. <laughs> yeah. Did you get, have you played a Canadian team yet? No. We, is there a Canadian team in your, in your pool, do you know? Um, I don't, I we think don't so, them, yeah. Today. I don't oh. think we'll play them, though. Okay, so, so hopefully maybe tomorrow you'll get to inter yeah. Uh, experience that in bracket play, maybe get matched up against one of the Canadian teams that are down here. Awesome. Samantha, what, what's a highlight for you of, of Ringneck? Um, this is my first year on this team too as well, and I really like having the downtime in between games. They're not just back-to-back, -back, and you can have a lot of fun time with um, um, our teammates and watching other um, teams play. Absolutely. Now what's fun about this is that you guys have the mics, so you guys have the power. Is there any funny stories you want to tell the, the Softball 605 family about your team that maybe maybe nobody else really knows? Get your quotes out. Alright, um, uh, well, um, there's a lot of inside jokes we have. Um, lots of quotes they say. Lots of catchy on things. <laughs> so you started to document these? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Especially Heidi. Yeah, well, Heidi's really funny. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what, what is maybe a highlight of a quote that you have? Okay, so this is from Heidi Barnum's. <laughs> she said, perfect, dash our coach. And she says, I know I am, but what about the pitch? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so looking forward to the later on in the, the tournament here this afternoon, um, do you know your next opponent? Yeah, we're yeah. Really against Nebraska. No, I think Minnesota. Oh, just Minnesota. Kidding, Minnesota. Minnesota. Then, then, then Nebraska. We just played a Nebraska yeah. team. Okay, so you've got a Minnesota team, and then you bounce back later on with the Nebraska yes. team. Okay. And what what what's maybe something you hope to improve on from the 8 a.m. game to the afternoon game? Well, for me, batting, but mostly like fly balls because I'm center field right now, and there was one fly ball that I'm kind of mad about that I didn't get. So I'm working on that, and especially batting because I I want to get home base. Absolutely. So. I hope I get to play because last game I had to sit out the entire game because it was nine in, nine out. So I only got to run the bases for the catcher. So I'm hoping I get to play and get the bats moving. And that's and that's what's kind of hard about yeah. you know when when you get into tournament play. Um, there's so many strategies that coaches have to think about and do. Um, but as you said, Samantha, you know you've got an important role just as much as the girls playing because when you get on base, you got to know the situations and you've got to be able to get across the plate to score that run when when you get on base, right? Yep, that's exactly right. And so, um, looking forward to seeing you ladies play the rest of the tournament. We wish you the best. Thank you. And uh, we'll, we'll check back in after your afternoon games. Okay, thank you. Softball 605, we'll be back with more interviews.